Robert Gagne's theory of hierarchical learning. Was an American educational psychologist best known for his conditions of learning. Gagne point pioneered the science of instruction during World War II when he worked with the Army Air Crops training pilots. He went to develop a series of studies and what that simplified and explained what he and others believed to be good instruction. Gagne was also involved in applying concepts of instructional theory to the design of computer based training and multimedia based learning. He was categorized eight level of hierarchical learning, different capacity for performance, type 1 single learning, type 2 stimulus response connection, type 3 motor chaining, fourth one type 4 verbal association type 5 multiple discrimination type 6 concepts type 7 results type 8 problem solving so look at this picture the hierarchy of learning Single learning, stimulus response, chaining, verbal association, discrimination learning, concept learning, rule learning and problem solving. And we are going to detail about it. Single learning, single learning same as the classical conditioning of behavioral psychologist Paolo. Second, SR learning, learning to respond to a discriminated stimulus, also known as trial and error, is a fundamental method of solving problems. Third one, chaining, acquired is a chain of two or more stimulus response. Confection chaining is a procedure used in behavioral psychology. It involves reinforcing individual responses occurring in a sequence to form from complex behavior. Fourth, verbal association. Learner is able to verbalize the acquired knowledge and intellectual skills in a highly organized manner. Fifth one, discrimination learning, different identifying response. In this, the learner and distinguishes one stimulus from another and respond as for the change in stimulus. Sixth concept learning, learning to give a common response to class of stimuli. In this subject acquire the ability to understand the common verbal properties of concept. Seventh rule learning, rule is chain of two or more concepts 
it helps to control behavior this refer high level cognition process it involves building relationship among two or more concepts before learning higher order rule that is enveloping them eight problem solving kind of learning that require the internal events that are usually called thinking it is formulating of new and complex rules and procedure for the purpose of solving the problem problem solving leads to permanent change in the learner's capabilities thank you have a wonderful day